I guess because we're here, I might as well just jump into the other thing I wanted to talk about today real quick. You guys are going to like this, I promise you. Uh, so I, I, I'm sure you guys have now been made aware that there are cheaters in Street Fighter 6. I'm sure you guys have seen the Sejam videos and stuff, the Detective Sejam stuff of people who are like frame one countering drive impacts and things. There's cheaters out and around. There, but the thing is, most of the cheaters that we've seen so far using cheats in this game are, generally speaking, real people. Like maybe gold pl level players who use cheats to kind of like protect them from things that they can't deal with in their mental stack. So for example, they will still be playing, a real human will be playing the game, but they've got a cheat set up that automatically counters drive impact, for example, because they, they just can't, they can't react to drive impact, so they cheat and use an auto DI break counter, right? We've seen those kinds of cheaters, a few people have made videos about them, but the cheaters have kind of given up at this point. I feel like any pretense of trying to make it look like a real person has just fallen apart. And uh, I want to show you guys one specific cheating account that makes me laugh so hard when I watch their replays. They're not even subtle. This is the least subtle cheater I've ever seen in my life. I saved a couple of replays here. This is a, a, a Chinese geef player called Xiao Pa Kai. And I just want you guys to look at this. This is fantastic. This is, this is like <laughs> the most shameless form of cheating I have ever seen in this game. You guys ready? Watch this. Modern Geef, by the way. Hmm, good anti-air. Nice. Instant anti-air, uh, area, air SPD. That's pretty nice. Okay. Ah! Frame one drive impact. Okay. Maybe it was a hard read. All right. Sure. Sure. Maybe. It's still possible. It could be a real Geef player. It's possible. I still believe this is a real person at this point. Okay. Nice perfect parry. Walking forward. Walking forward. Nice perfect <laughs> Nice perfect parry. Believable. Nice perfect parry. Good shit. Peak performance. Breaks the throw, frame one. He's not even pressing normals, he's just walking forward. Slaps him in the face. There's a body of iron right there. Look at this. Walk forward, perfect parry. Walk forward, walk forward. Lariat. Instant, <laughs> instant anti-air uh, air SPD. Walk forward. Frame one DI. He's not even pressing buttons. <laughs> Auto DI script. Once again. And perfect parry. Is this Ultra Instinct Snake Eyes? Let me just show you one more. One more. This, this, I also noticed from this person's profile, nobody ever rematches them. I can't imagine why. It's always, it's always the one and done, every single time. The thing is, I feel like you could beat this script, because if you notice, the only thing that it doesn't perfect parry every single time is fireballs. They don't seem to know how to deal with fireballs. I think you could actually beat this. With a basic, like, fireball DP zoning game. But if you press any normal, you're fucked. But this is crazy, like, people have just given up. The people who tried to make the cheating look even slightly real they clearly were wasting their time. <laughs> because this is something else. I love the walk-up perfect parry, it's so good. Yeah, Twitter detectives were like studying people's inputs. To truly figure things out because they were they were quite good at hiding it originally and now they just don't care anymore and you get stuff like this air spd frame one di 
You may not like it, but this is what peak performance Zangief gameplay looks like. <laughs> Air SPD. Brain 1 DI. This is like biblically accurate Zangief. People, people just don't care anymore. People are out here with every single cheat turned on. Auto DI, yep, I'll have one of those. Uh, perfect parry everything, uh, I'll have that. Uh, you know, I'll have, I'll have all of the cheats, please. I'll turn them all on at the same time. Can you see if he has any losses and how they go? Um, I think he does have losses. I assume the losses are just characters using fireballs to zone them out. Look, no one ever rematches this guy. It's different characters every single time. Ah, oh, there we go. There's a loss. <laughs> I assume game one was the DJ player figuring out what was going on here. This is the DJ player is getting data right now. This is this is adaptation in progress. Nice combo. I'm invincible. I don't think the DJ player is a bot. Alright, so what adaptations did the DJ player make to bring this back? What happened after this point? What did they what did they figure out? What does Bro know? I noticed that, yeah, you, so I, I don't know if you guys have seen, I think the bot, maybe because it's not like perfect on every single frame, but it does drop the uh, the perfect parry sometimes and gets a regular parry. I assume there's like a frame difference happening where the bot is just like out of sync for a couple frames. Because it, it hits the perfect parry like 95% of the time, but it misses occasionally. How did they bring this back? Oh, okay, I see. I, th I think what's happening here is that the player using the bot very occasionally is taking control and pressing buttons. And when they do, they get immediately bodied for it. I think that's what's happening. Every single time, the... Wow. My loyal fans. Nice jump back. I think that's what's happening. I think when the scrub who's operating the cheating account takes over control from the the script and presses like medium punch, that's when he's getting hit. Because when he's just walking forward, he never makes mistakes. But when he tries to instigate an attack, he's almost always wrong. I think that's what's going on here. What can't deal with cross-ups? Yeah, body. Yeah, I think that's what's happening. I think underneath all of the bot and all the cheating, there's like an iron rank player with absolutely no clue how to play Street Fighter who occasionally tries to take take the reins of the controls and presses like a button or tries to anti-air by themselves and just gets completely smoked for it. That's crazy. Even when you're being handed an auto pa what is it? Auto perfect parry auto DI, also auto throw break script. Even when you've got those three things carrying you, there are still players in this world that can't win. You should be ashamed. That is embarrassing. Don't insult iron players like that. I'm not insulting iron players, I'm insulting this guy. Anyway, I thought you guys would find that funny. That's, that's like the most, the most blatant cheat I've ever seen in this game. Not even close.